Exercise your willpower to change direction. Set some higher goals. Reach for some higher purpose. Go for something beyond what you thought you could do. Face all your fears. That's how you conquer them. Say, here's what I'm afraid of. I wonder what I could do to change that. Pick a new destination and start going that way. Now you can change one little degree at a time, or if you want to, you can revolutionize the whole thing. Who says you couldn't revolutionize the whole thing in a week's time and start a brand new direction that will most assuredly help you arrive in a brand new place a year from now, three years from now? No telling five years from now where you could arrive. Use your willpower to start the process. Anybody can change. You don't have to repeat last year. Clean up the errors. Invest it now in the next year. Watch it make the difference. I want you to know when you dream your dream that there are other people who are dreaming the exact same dream. When you said to yourself, when the ball comes down, this is what I want to accomplish. You're not the only person that wants to accomplish it. And now I ask you this question. What do you do when a thousand other people want exactly what you want? What do you do when you're not the only one that wants to make a million dollars in your company? You're not the only one that wants to be a CEO. What if you're not the only one that wants what you want? What if there are thousands of other people who want what you want? You have to outwork them. You gotta outcrime them. You gotta get up earlier. You gotta stay up later. You've gotta execute and you've gotta go from 70 to 120. I wish I could tell you 70% is enough. But it's not gonna happen. So I need you to understand something. You can have it if you want it. But the bigger the dream, the harder the grind. We're taught in football to fight from the first whistle to the last whistle. It doesn't matter how tired you are, it doesn't matter how much pain you're in, and it doesn't matter what that scoreboard says. You give it everything you got. And I know I've been through a lot in my life. Things that most people would give up going through. But as long as I have breath in my lungs, I'm gonna fight for the life I deserve. For the life that my family deserves. And I challenge you, whatever you're going through, it doesn't matter what you're going through, to leave it all out on the field, to fight for four quarters. Because as long as there's time left on that clock, you're still in the game. So never give up.